Welcome back everyone, Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me today to this new episode of Music with Nick. Today we got a little bit more salsa that we're going to play and uh, thank you so much Jose for sticking to your guns and saying I'm gonna request more salsa and I love it. I always get in the best mood with these reactions. Unfortunately the salsa community is not yet established you know so the videos are uh, I love them they usually don't get that many views but slowly but surely I'm sure they're gonna get more and more and just all the salsa lovers um, will have to you know check out the channel and then they'll see that we have an entire empire of songs here on this uh, this is some more Hector Lavoe uh, Lavo. Um, uh, and this is, we're going to do Vamos a Reir un, po un Poco, Let's Laugh a Little, uh, is the translation. And the album is called De Ti Depende, and the, It Depends on You, from 1976. Now, let's see here real quick. I want to see if um, Jose added some notes to this. Let's see. No, just uh, the song and... And a thank you. Thank you, Jose. Thank you so much. And like I said, you know, um, sooner or later, you know, there's going to be people who are going to be like, you know, I subscribe to your channel because of the salsa. You're the only channel who does it. And pretty much I think I, I we are um, or I am, you know, for now that I have more time than Alexa. But yeah, let's get it started. This is a um, an epic request. Uh, vamos a reír un poco. And, uh, oh no, it's not an epic, it's uh, barely under eight minutes, so it's still a normal request. But yeah, it's the album opener. I'm sure um, I'm going to show it to Alexia once uh, she comes home. I usually put these on um, on the TV and then she's like, oh, this is kind of cool. Yeah, I reacted to it, you know, and stuff like that. So, But uh, yeah, let's uh, let's get it started with this. And uh, I always get in, like, like I said into the best mood with this with this music but here we go um and this is not even the most you know played song on the album but i like it i like also to do the deep cuts uh to do the not so famous uh, things um even when it comes to salsa and stuff like that but uh here we go with vamos a rir un poco let's laugh a little here we go thank you again jose thank you so much everyone for being here let's go Yeah. 
This is so good, man. I mean, it just it just doesn't end. It's so, and once they start, it's like this force, you know. Um, I can't do it. I can't sing it. It's so complex, and the time signatures, and all the instruments, and the trumpets, and the percussion, and the way they always harmonize. These are always two, three singers with you know, the main singer is singing his lines and they always kind of like inject the ba 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 da ba da ba da ba da ba Man, this is such good music. It's such a shame, you know, that people don't... It's I know it's a cultural thing, you know, it's like, oh, why don't you listen to country, you know? Why don't you listen more to, I don't know, like um, Celtic music, you know? Because you have to be from the region or you have to have lived in a country like a spanish speaking country at least or visit it and and that way you get it you know i it's it, obviously it's like listening maybe like if somebody would play me bavarian music you know um well i would listen to it of course because i've listened to it like all my childhood but um but yeah i guess that's what i'm trying to say and again he's born on he was born on my birthday as well we share the same birthday and uh, he also shares the same year um, with my mom. Um, uh, so that's kind of cool. But he died very, very young, at, only at 46. Um, very tragic. I, I went over this entire story. Very, very tragic. Um, but, you know, it, it is what it is. Those 46 years that he did live on this earth, he, I mean, look what he left behind. Amazing. That's amazing. Um, let's go back, you know, it's just so, so wonderful. I just wanted to in interject real quick that this is just amazing music. It's just wonderful. And it's so full of flavor and sabor and how they roll the R's. It took me years to be able to do that, by the way. Um, but yeah, wonderful. Let's, let's keep going. <laughs>
so good. I'm I'm looking at these. Um, I pulled up, you know, just his name and images, and it's funny that there's not that many pictures of him. I guess you know, um, there's just one picture that's like over and over. Um, and it's even like people like paint him a lot, you know, then I see paintings of that same picture and, uh, murals and even tattoos. And, uh, I've talked about this. He was like La Voz, the voice, you know? And, um, so he's like this, this legend, you know? And, uh, I, I see all articles like the night that Pablo Escobar made uh, Hector sing all night and crazy. So, um, who knows in which, you know, things he was entangled with, you know, like, uh, because like I said, it was very tragic. He tried to kill himself, you know, and, uh, uh, jumped out of a, the ninth floor, you know, out of a window and did survive. So that was just horrible. But, you know, sometimes people just do things, uh, because of other circumstances, you know, so that he was going through a lot in his life. But man, this music is just wonderful. And uh, it's, it's a wonderful thing, you know, salsa and merengue. Uh, I just I hope, you know, more people, you know, listen, would listen to this, you know, but I can't <laughs> force anyone. I've tried, you know, to uh the, the with the titles you know and the the thumbnails of people maybe to pique their interest but it's also yeah like i said it is it's a cultural thing and uh it has to be like oh if oh this is salsa on oh, i'm not gonna listen to this you know so i get it i totally get it but uh maybe after a while you know people will get the um the feel for it you know it is it is different of course um, well, thank you again so much, Jose. This was wonderful. I mean, I can't say enough good things about this. Everything, every song that I hear that has, you know, these arrangements and the way everything is arranged, um, is just wonderful. You know, every single time it's always, and also the lyrics, of course, you know, so it's always a pleasure to listen to this music and, um, there's so many good hits and like i said this is not even there's a song that has 73 million plays this only has 4 million but imagine how good that other one must be you know although i think you know with spotify it's not really about what's best it's just i guess what sold the most is what's more popular has more plays but sometimes even songs that are not the best ones um, they have the most amount of views because it's just because it's more popular and stuff like that. So I see that with bands that I like and I'm like, why, why would that be considered the best? It's just because it's sold more, you know, but this was wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Jose, for requesting another, you know, epic for me. These are epics. They're very, very, a lot of fun to listen to, to absorb, learn, you know, Although this kind of music is so hard to play, like it's not even funny. And um, I, d I wouldn't even know where to start with a guitar, you know, I guess with a keyboard. But the chord progressions here are so insane. And just all the arreglos, you know, all the little different nuances of the song, all the way everything is, you know, put into into play is, is insane. Wonderful. Thank you so much, everyone, for watching this. Please, if you do, leave a comment. Let us know um, um, if you watched it, what do you think, all that good stuff. Thank you, Jose, for sponsoring this. I appreciate it. Thank you, and I'll see you all in the next video.